Thank you so much for joining me this game edge. We are back in War of the Walkers, and yes, I've got myself a pristine location for where we want to build. I, I do like this area quite a bit, so I'm thinking about building right here, and that is gonna be what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna I'm gonna build right here. I, I'm gonna build right over here. So f meanwhile, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna place to make some room. My god, I have not a lot of room, but I'm still gonna wanna place my bike so it doesn't get lost. Uh they're well known to disappear, it's just in case, guys. FYI. I mean, if you never played this game before. Uh, yeah, it, just be careful. It's it's going to disappear, and if not, so just make yourself a little uh, a little area where you can actually safeguard all your goodies here. Your bike, which is your main goodie, your your main one. Can you just give me like one second to finish up? Seriously, had to interfere, didn't you? You and you hit me, you little shit. Huh? Huh? You hit me. Yeah, you touched me. Son of a bitch. You two, you want to come in? Right, let's do this. Let's rock this shit. Okay. Hey, Bells? Does somebody else want some of this? Did you see what I just did to your friends? I didn't think so. All right. I'm just going to place down some wraps here. And, um, yeah. I'm just going to get this done so that we have this completed. We can take out our whippersnapper here. Let's get this all completed as fast as we possibly can. Get rid of all the goodies. You just have to click and hold down pretty much. And it does pretty much all the work you need to. As long as you're looking down on the ground, I guess. It makes it a lot easier. There we go. Boom, 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 boom. Whipper, snipper, alert. And this is pretty cool. Yeah, this is actually what a regular one hand weeder. So, yeah, a whole lot easier than trying to sit there. You don't use up all the stamina for no reason. So, you can actually utilize this and pretty much clean up the other one. Now, there's other ones in the Starvation mod and other mods. I think it's uh, Val mod also has a lawnmower, which seems to be a little bit, I guess, easier in a way, but it also has its problems. So, it's not perfect, but it's definitely a lot easier. Especially the weeds were never kind of sprack like this. It kind of makes a pain in the arse. But we're good to go. We're good. This is going to be not a big problem. We're going to have to place down whatever we can on this sucker here. And at the same time, we're just picking up all the weeds we can now. At the same time you're doing this, you should be picking up like weeds, other things. If you go to other areas, you can pick up seeds and stuff from what I've heard. Uh, I've yet to do so. I've not gone to the green area, uh, green biome where you can pick up all the good stuff. So it's okay. It's okay. Let's just clean up. It takes two seconds to get done. And this is a setup for a new base here. So it's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to try and get as much done as we can today. We'll hit this up to get rid of this, even if it's not really in my way. Just because it's there. I'm going to need this anyways. Uh, Iron-wise, I don't have an iron mine, so I'm picking up whatever I can on the surface. Which, in theory, is plenty. It's plenty. It is, uh, it's more enough to pick up at the beginning, especially. I mean, a mine is nice. Don't get me wrong. I do prefer the mine. Does it give me seeds at all? No. Eh? Give me any seeds. I thought it would give me something. All right, it's all good. It's all good in the neighborhood. Let's go and uh, pick up a little bit more of this junk here. Reconfiguring this area. Now, you don't really need to do this as much, but when you start placing things down, it does make it a lot easier to have to sit here and hit all these fibrous shit. So if you missed the last episode, you should go and check it out. We hit a lot of point of interest. Really cool. I do like this uh, right here. This is, means there's some ores and something down below, too. And uh, right here, we got ourselves some clay. Really nice. Close knit. And we can actually dig this all up. This is all clay here. Oh, that's all clay. Beautiful. Some nice spots, too, coming up. Oh, I'm liking this. The spots over there are just beautiful. All right, we're almost cleaned up all this area here. we got ourselves a little bit of friends that still want to visit us. You can just kind of place this down and run if you want to and go crazy. See, this pretty much destroys everything on its wake. That is really a lot of fun. Let's see what it does to this guy. Doesn't do very well. Entity wise damage. But this one, oh, this one. This one's just vicious. Yeah. Yeah, as you can see, my clubs and everything else is up to date, so I can build up to 400. What I did is I used my old weapons, of course, on the bench, and moved them up one extra, where I could. The uh, crossbow, I made uh, two extra crossbows and used my old one, 260-something, and moved it up. Uh, I cannot upgrade, of course, my diamond pickaxe a lot yet, because I don't have tungsten. Well, I have some tungsten. I don't have enough, maybe, to... I don't know if I have enough to make one, but I, don't have, I can't make it right now to level 100, from what I was told. And uh, what I read, sorry, here we go. What player am I? What level? Doesn't even tell me here. It's right here then. I'm level 87. So yeah, level 87. It is what it is. It's okay. We're almost there. Just gotta work a little harder. Once we start building, getting stuff done, it will increase a whole lot faster. We've done a whole lot of construction work. So those points are just lying there waiting for, for us to kind of give it up and give it to them. So it's very sweet. All right, let's just clean up this last little bit. I guess I can kind of run at it, eh? There we go. You can actually wrench this if you want to. Oh, we can just use that. Wow, it actually gives you with the whipper. Nice. 
Nice. Sweet. Usually I use a wrench on those things. All right, let's clean that last bits and pieces of this area here. It's not going to be perfect. Uh, I'll, I'll get the rest of them done afterwards. I don't want to bore you guys with just whippersnippering the crap of this area. But I know a lot of you are asking, can you show us how you set up your base and stuff? I know it's different. Everybody has their own way of doing things. Uh, but I, I do like to set it up by clearing up an area, making it look as nice as possible. Make sure nothing's in the way. Also, so that I pick up resources. And with the, what I have here, this is insane. It is insane. I also have an HD. Oops, take this one. There we go. I have an HD, of course, nail gun. So it's going to be a whole lot faster. You got to be careful. It builds really quick. So if I have any like forge stuff, I want to avoid that as much as possible. I don't want to get caught with too much stuff and start upgrading it to a point where I can't un-upgrade. All right. Oops, there's a little rock there. That's going to annoy you when you start building those little pebbles. All right, let's just bring our bike onto where I want to. Boom, boom, boom. This will be where we safeguard our bike. Beautiful. I'm not upgrading that yet because I want to move it. I'm just going to get rid of him for right now. There we go. Thanks, buddy. I do appreciate you for not giving me anything at all, you little shite. Oh, there we go. Some more lootable areas. Now, our other main base we have right now that we have, in case of emergency, we can use that for our our main our main base until we're 100% sure of where we're going to stay. Now, look at all the ores and stuff just around the corner from us. I mean, holy crap. We can pretty much have no problems getting all the resources we want. I'm loving this. All right, let's chop down this tree. I do want to get the chainsaw and the auger, too. I'm going to need to get those. I can see what I need to build those. I know a lot of you are saying, get the HD auger. I never got to play with an auger. And in all the years I played with this game, I never got to. So that will be interesting. No, 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 no. We, do, we don't want to throw our rebar frames down, please. I'm just going to dig this up really quick. This, of course, is iron. We don't have any specialty ones. We are stuck with the iron. But I was able to upgrade that in our... Right here, I'll show you guys. In our skill points, so what I did is I upgraded here, went to extras. I see this one's uh, got to be a level 100. God, can't wait for that. I uh, got steel. I brought that up to steel. And, of course, I upgraded my tool to 8. Same thing for weapons. I'm up to 8 right now. All right, I'm shivering right now. Oops. And I'm also hurt. Let's use this. Let's take this off. There we go. This got to remove about 10 degrees. Right, let's clear that up. Clear that up. And I still want to dig this baby up. Is this f slow as hell to dig or what? Maybe it's just better off to pickaxe this shit. Yeah, it's still faster pickaxe. I thought because I sounded like dirt that it'd be faster, but definitely the diamond pickaxe just takes care of it. Just rips it apart in pieces. Look at that. Hardly using any stamina too. That's nice. Sweet. Oh, man, resources. Resources everywhere. I'm so happy. This shit is what you want when you first start this game, and now you can get it. Sure, nice to get on the surface and I have to dig too deep. Not that I don't like mining. I love mining. I think mining is exciting, but especially when you're first starting, you want to build a base. Uh, preferable to do it uh, on the top if you can to survive a little bit longer. All right, a bike's over there. All right, I'm not going to be able to clear all this. It's going to take forever. The lawnmower seems to work better, I think. This one's good, but... I don't know if running is just better. I think running is better. Yeah, I think it's just a little bit better. Anyways, it is what it is. We'll clear police this area here. We'll place down the frames now, and uh, we'll get going. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, it's not perfect. Ah, who cares? Okay, so let's start building from here. We're going to start from the outskirts here, and we're going to start placing down some frames. I'm gonna, I also made some, of course, some white concrete. Now, these ones you cannot... You cannot, I repeat, and people always say that, why don't you use rebar? I cannot make wet rebar, or wet, sorry, wet, uh, sorry, rebar poles. So that is going to be a problem. I can't do that. I'll have to actually space out what I wanted to do. So that is going to be one of those little tickery things. I did want to build the auger and get this going because I have to dig at least one deep. But for now, let's do the layout of this base. Just the layout. 
Or too bad, because I did do 25 or 25 instead, so that worked out a lot better, plus the calculation. So I didn't want to do that in front of you guys and really bore you. I did probably record a little bit of it, and I decided to opt out on it, uh, because it's it's just calculating, and you can probably hear me do more of a Sesame Street moment, where we're going to, one, two, three, four, five... You know, it just, it's annoying after a while. So we just I just decided to skip that part forward. I'm just placing these down. Uh, when they go down one, it's okay. It's not a big deal because it just it just tells me how the, the actual platforms are and how the floor and the ground is going to be. The ground will never be perfect. You might have some pristine land uh, if you destroy a POI that's quite, you know, quite large. Uh, but you'll never have like uberly perfect land at all times. So you kind of have to work with it. It's not a big deal. All right. Um, we can actually get rid of that, get rid of that. Let's get rid of this in the middle. So this area here is going to be needed. Plus, I'm going to be going out a couple more on the outside. So I'm going to show you guys that too. Here. Now, this portion here, you're probably saying, what are you going to do? Well, you have a couple of really uh, different ways you can actually run this. Uh, from here, you see these parts here that are kind of like uneven. You can actually sort these out kind of here like this. There you go. I'll pull these back out. There you go. Boom. You can actually lower these if you want to. And of course, you can add some more sod if you want to. And you can even it off. This will actually even off the terrain for you. Uh, so you can understand a little better where you have to build. I do have to dig anyways one deep to put down all, of course, concrete and stuff. So I'm not too worried about this. This is actually just makes it a little bit less to deal with. There we go. Again, you can you can manipulate this to go as far as you want, as long as you want, and you know, as smooth as you possibly want. So it's not a big issue. I'm going to... I have to get rid of all this stuff anyways here. There we go. Beautiful. And again, you see how it's uneven here? I know a lot of people ask this, how you smooth it out. Well, this is... You can do it with also wood frames. Wood frames work extremely well. I usually do it with wood frames. I just so happen to have rebar on me. And I just start to swap it out with that. Look at this. Boom, boom. Look how this is all turning out to be flat as hell. Yeah, I've been using that for many... Many times, and I've been using it, well, it's been my favorite way of fixing up my land as I possibly can, just storing up as many as these I can. It gets almost addicting to do, because if you like everything nice and perfect shape and all that, this would be your best bet to get it all done prim and proper. Again, it's easy to pick up afterwards, and you'll see it's it looks pretty damn good. <laughs> it looks pretty damn good. All right. This area will be all the ones that the actual crates run. is all flat. Of course, it doesn't raise when it's steep, but it's okay. It works. Let's drop those two. Sweet. Nice, easy way to do it. All right, so you can spend hours, like I mentioned, doing that, or hours. You know, a little bit of time doing that. But for now, we don't have to worry about that too much. We're just going to grab all the frames we need here. And from here, we're actually going to have our walls. Now, the tough part of this one is that I'm going to be putting up my walls down a bit and back up. And that's the reason why I want that is because I won't do up to upside down spikes. Reason, it just doesn't make any sense to me. I am 100% sure that will be fixed. It's a bug. Now, the frames, it just doesn't look good for me mentally that when I see the actual frames with that uh, upside down, it just doesn't make any sense. Now, that's my personal decision, not yours. They don't have to be that way. I know that, you know, uh, some people do it, and that's fine. That is your choice. I just find it looks like it doesn't look real enough for me. Just something throws me off on it. I don't know. For my build, personally, I just can't do it. Maybe habit, maybe just the way it is, but I cannot put those things upside down. So I know they stop them from jumping down, but if I make it one deep, I'll have the spikes out and I don't have to flip those upside down, which is perfectly fine. All right, we have our square here, which is great, but I'm also going to be wanting to close this into a frame base. And that means right over here. All right, with 10 out all the way across here on each side of this actual square. So this is 25 and this is 10 out, not from the side. So you're counting 10 from the first block out. So it's 10 out there. We're going to be placing those right down. That's good. And here I'm going to have to start digging a little bit. And I do want to get the auger. Don't get me wrong, but I'm going to have to dig with what I have for now. I also have to dig on the left-hand side and put down some cement blocks. That is going to be a must. We're also going to dig here straight one shot and give ourselves a double level. So this right now on top to the left-hand side isn't actually supposed to be there on a top level. So we're going to have to just kind of make our way through here. You'll see what I'm talking about in a second. There's a little more of a building and digging kind of episode. I know it's not unusual. It's just kind of unusual for me. Uh, not to not kind of fast forward to do this off camera, but I, I do usually sometimes like to show what I'm doing here on the side so it's not a big, big deal. This way, you know, people want to build all of ways. There we go. Perfect. This will be real nice. On the inside, I don't have to worry about it right away. I'll do that last because that's going to take some time. I'll probably dig at night. 
where I have more time to do things like that. Right now here, I have to watch out for my stamina too. So same time while I'm waiting for my stamina to perk back up. I actually grab these if you want to. Now you can also make the blocks themselves. Uh, this is just more funny because you pick up and place back down. The blocks themselves you cannot replace. So that is a bit of a pain. But uh, yeah, you can do it very, very quickly and very easily for you guys. It's not without any problems. Take a little drink, make sure we're all good to go. There we go. Perfect. Just digging this right across the front. Right here. All right, there we go. And this one's going to go right, whoops, number eight. Now, I usually like to do two down on these ones uh, below, and it's very possible I might have to because I have to dig this across. But I just want to show you guys what it looks like on this standard when I place it down. Uh, this block here across down here is going to go one deep on it. And the reason for that is going to be the spikes. So I'm going to check out to see how it looks on the left-hand side because of spikes. I might have to actually do two deep on this one. So that, yeah, I'm going to have to do two deep on this one. I don't have a choice. I'm going to do a double shot. Pick these all up. Boom, 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 boom. Come on, B. Excellent. Definitely gonna invest in that auger. <laughs> I'm gonna try very hard to get all the parts and everything I need for that. Probably end up uh, having to go and. Well, I think we can build most of it on the bench, but I'll double check it afterwards. Let's just get that second shot done here. Let's see if we get any kind of problems here. It looks like it's gonna be perfect. It's going to be perfect. Absolutely stunning. Now will be a double shot, so I'll place down a block, and once I get exhausted, I'll stop and turn around and start placing down the blocks, one here and one below the other side. So there'll be two of them. I'll have to also upgrade those. There we go. Now we're getting a little tired, so utilize this time. I could take, of course, grain alcohol and all that other goodies if you want to. That is up to you. Tend not to do it very much because I have so much to do. Oh, oh shit! I hate wasting the frame. There we go. Bring her all the way down. Sweet. Oh, um, I love building. Now it doesn't look like much right now. Don't get me wrong. It's not gonna look like anything right now until we get the the, the main stuff put down. In the the floor in at least a square down and then get the walls up and running still a lot of work left to be done but this is the best part laying out your base getting it all prim and proper all right let's bring this back again you can put the blocks on but you make a mistake it to destroy them i don't know I'm doing both ways to show you guys. You guys can choose which one you would prefer. Some people have debates on which one they prefer and which one is better value. But that will be up to you to choose. Not me. Not me. Alright, here comes the HD. Look how fast this is. It looks like a fast forwarded. Damn it. That's sweet. Look how fast. Oh my god, that's amazing. I love this thing. All right, now we can actually place down the other block here across and bring that all the way across here. Boom, boom, boom. And this will be your base. Turn on the light here so you guys can see a little better. It's starting to get a little darker. What time is it now? It's uh, 1400, that's why. Oh, well, we'll stay outside and have some fun. We'll have some fun. Uh, right here, two, and this might be spikes and that. I have to decide that afterwards. That won't be that one. Uh, this one, no. There. This is going for it. Yes. Just double checking. Look at that. Moving up. Moving on up. That is perfect. All right, good. Now here in the bottom. We can actually put our spikes up too, if we want to. But first, we're just going to dig one more here. These are going to be the ones that kind of tilt your way back up. You'll see what I'm doing. And you're going to need this, again, a double level to protect it. Just to do it the right way. You know what I'm saying? Just do it the right way. 
I hope you guys are enjoying this. I hope you guys can also share with me what you guys are doing in the comment fields. I can always go on Discord and share your your builds too if you want to. Uh, show up pictures, you know, your screenshots you guys are taking. Show them up on the actual uh, Discord. There's tons of Ravenhurst, uh, War of the Walker mod, uh, different chats, and all that. a lot of people do share their builds over there. Always interested in seeing what you guys are up to. All right, now we're starting to slow down a bit. Let's bring this across here. Walls, baby, walls. Oh, yeah, I wish it was HD way of place this. Bring that back. Boom. Boom. Am I stuck? There we go. There. Oh, we're doing good. We got a good time here. This is actually really good. By tomorrow morning, I'm going to have pretty much most of this completed. And uh, I think I have enough. Actually, I don't have that many rebar left. Might have to go back home and build myself some more. Uh, let's see, rebar. Yeah, everything's got to be built in the actual thing. So if you guys are looking for this in case, this is actually the frames themselves. I built all these ones here. I also built another 200 inside the forge. So you just have to have clay and iron get going. So I know a lot of people ask about the rebars inside the con fields. And you can make those. So again, you can make the blocks themselves without any kind of worries. We'll just put down the last bit of these, and then we'll go and pick up some more. I didn't think I was going to use that much, to tell you the truth, but I guess I used a lot more than expected. It's all good. Six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, right down to one. Ooh. All right, that's good. We'll go back to the actual base. And there we go. Perfect. And then from here, these ones would be actually the actual... Uh, where are they again? Spikes. Did I just take them with me? They did 250 of them. Beauty. And these ones, I'll be putting them down right here. See how many you're taking from one side? It'd be 25 on one side. Yeah, I should have enough of those. Let's go back to our forge and pick up the rest of the rebar. Yeah, we're going to need that for the top here. Again, you can always craft up the blocks themselves with the actual cement here. Let's say the blocks, um, let's see, concrete, wet concrete block, you can make these up too. Again, it just takes up 10 of them if you want to. You can actually create um, 10 concrete. You can create as much as you want, like 700 of these. We can actually make, I don't know, let's take 25 of these. It's going to take 40 seconds. We're going to finalize at least that portion of it. You don't need to upgrade them either. And that does resolve some portions. I mean, overall, I don't really see a big difference between using them. I do like these, except for mistakes you make. When mistakes are made, like I just did there, uh, those will cost you. Those will cost you big time. And plus, a rebar, is, like I mentioned, is up. You know, you can place it. You don't have to worry about it. When you make a mistake, you pick it back up. It does make a big difference. I do like building these like these. A lot of times, you'll see me do it. Uh, but again, it's a preference. Whatever I decide to do, uh, that day I decide I want to play with that. This way, this way I go. There we go. Perfect. We got all of them. Yeah, let's put the extra one. Look how nice that's gonna look. Ooh, it's gonna look so sweet. All right, uh, we have the other frames here that go across. We can place those down afterwards. Okay, we need that. All right, let's get our bike. It'll be a whole lot faster through our, our nice bike. Head back right away and pick up the rest of that load. So to take apart this, there's this building here. Did I ever break it? I don't think I've broken into this one yet. Did I not break? Oh, I did break into this one. I was like, what the hell? I thought I took out most of the stuff. All right, there's our trees I planted a while back, and there's our base currently. It's pretty much a little square, but it's, it works. It works. Ours won't be a square completely, don't worry. It's, it's, there's a lot more to it. A lot more to it. Alright. Let's go down here. Let's go pick up more rebar frames. And here. Pick up all this stuff. Wow, we already a lot of concrete going. Alright. Um, I'm going to do some more rebar. Bar frames do uh, at this point, who cares? I can put it back in here. 
400. And how much do I have of ramps right now? Where are my ramps? 106 cents. These. And 391 ramps. Okay, we're not going to have to touch any more of those. These are the inside corners. Okay, and that is the pillars in case I need them. Perfect. And then the cement. Let's continue that. Stone is down zero. I do have a lot of it going. We picked up quite a bit of it, so we're doing pretty darn good. We have enough of everything else. We should be okay. We should be okay. It is very quiet. Don't you find for... Uh, I don't find it very quiet. There should be, like, some zombies out in there, I think, but there's not many. They're all scared of us. Actually, there was one thing I wanted to check out before we do anything. Sorry, guys. There's one thing I wanted to check out, and I keep on forgetting to do it. There was this place... I saw it when I came back into town. A place on the hill over here. I'm not mistaken, I think there's a bunker here. Where are you? There. It might be a bunker. I don't know. I didn't break into it. So let's see. It is a bunker. Nice. Just uh, closes up so we don't have any friends that show up. Oh, yeah, it is a bunker. Yeah, okay, I've seen these ones before. I should have probably left some stuff on top. It's pretty cool, though, you have to admit. <laughs> it's a mini bunker. This is really just underground, right? I'm going to double check to see that everything is not hidden anything special. I don't need anything else. Let's just smash those up. Oh, some box up here. Nicely hidden, too. There's the auger schematic. I know I have it already. Now, we could use a wrench, like I mentioned. That is very possible. And yes, I still grab my chairs. All right, we have this way. We know it. That is good. Scrap. We have tons of that. Scrap. We can actually eat the apple if we want to. Now, we could. I know it's driving some people mad watching me doing that, smashing those things up. So, I'll just make you guys feel better by using the HD wrench because it doesn't take that long to do. We'll grab all the resources. We have so much of it that it's that's the reason why. But I do want to check behind these walls. For anything hidden. Man, that's a lot of scrap here. Holy shite. We took apart that good plastic for that. Nothing in a shamboy box. Nothing in a shamboy box. Piece of crap, piece of crap. Some lead. Nothing there. Man! It's not the best bunker ever. But it is something. It's gonna still double check to see the area. Too quick. There must have been nothing inside. Let's get rid of everything we have here. This way I can actually check and see every ounce I can in this area. I'm pretty sure there'll be something hidden, but usually they use a different kind of block to kind of tell you there's something hidden behind it. Let's grab you. Can take all the mattresses. Nobody's sleeping here. You're gonna get light pipes and stuff. That's pretty sweet. Something upstairs? It's not like a human. A non zombie. Hey buddy, are you a traitor? You're not? 
Uh, this is my land. Yeah, my land. Sorry, I, I was going to help you, but I, I don't like people snooping around. I'm tired of you guys shooting me for no reason. All right, holy shite! Forge tungsten. I, 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 I'm. Oh, that's the second time it's happened. But I didn't get that much last time. Holy moly! Okay. Let's take that and place the forge tungsten in a very secure area. <laughs> oh my god, that's so awesome! Might actually be able to upgrade my weapons. That'd be so sweet. Um, not going to need any more worms. Don't need really the dirt right now. I have more than enough. Let's grab you. Sure, whatever. Just place the stuff in here. Damage. No, take that back. Take that back. Take it back. Stuff we don't need right now. There we go. That that I need. That actually should be in here. I don't know why it's outside my bike. There we go. Uh, and this too actually should be in here. I'll scrap you up. And the rest of the stuff stays with moi. This is all our main stuff that we need for building. We have AK. We have our other stuff. I wasn't really expecting to spend that much time here, but damn. I want to see if there's anything hidden. That guy had forged tungsten. Are you freaking kidding me? Anyone think it's hidden up here? Oh, it's going to take forever. I don't have time for that. I have way too much to do. I have to get some building done. Oh, yeah. Oops. Didn't check you guys. How you doing? How you doing? Nice boxes. Nothing. Let's do a shamway there. More jelly. Make some jelly sandwiches. That's wood. Let's double check to see behind here. This would be a perfect place for it to hide. A hidden place, but I don't think there's anything hidden in this one. It's very standard. But we never know. Just pot shots around, see. There's nothing here. No. Okay. I, I'm pretty sure if I missed it, I'm so sorry, guys. I mean, I, I, I'm just double checking, but I don't have time to do the whole place. I would come back if I needed all the actual resources, but I do not need it. No, there's nothing. A couple of tester holes. We're good. We messed up this place pretty good. Everybody moves in here. They got some serious renos to get done. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. All right, let's get the hell out of here. Whoops. Pretty darn nice, though. I am impressed with that. Nice and small, but does a job. Pretty weak, but hey, it really does work. These ones here we've taken care of. I haven't gone to that big house yet. We will do that. We will. Uh, for now, we're going to have to head back. Shots fired. My In my, my hood. Any more forged tungsten in your ass? Oh, she's shooting up good. George, unacceptable behavior. Eh? You should be over there fighting. You coward. Yeah, that's a nice gun. It is a very nice gun you have. Yep, that's very, very nice. <laughs> Zombie Defense Force. How you doing? Hello. They didn't give me what I wanted. I wanted more stuff. It's okay. We'll have to deal with it. I was hoping for some real goody like tungsten again. That was too damn sweet. That's what it was. What do you want? What do you want? What do you want? What do you want? Huh? I mean, those things are useful. They are useful to shoot. Oh, wow. Did you see a compound bow in this one? 520, 528. Holy crap. I could drop some of this stuff off at home. That seems a little ridiculous not to, doesn't it? It does. Blaring the lights. 
Uh, we do have that jump off box right here on the outside, so I'm not going to worry about it. What's up with this shit? Hey. Hey. Do you have a permit for that shit? You need to register with me from now on. Do you understand? All right. Carry on. Give me your bag. Give me your bag. Thank you. God. That was pretty shitty. It wasn't worth a bullet. All right, we're going to drop off all the things on the top shelf here. I'll say there's no zombies and all of them are... Oh, I hurt myself. There we go. Hurt myself on the spikes. I should have a drop-off box right downstairs. Oh, I forgot the stuff in the bike. Ah, whatever. I have to come back. Not a big problem. Actually, it wouldn't hurt to drink. That, 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 and that. There we go. I'll worry about all that good stuff afterwards. I shall pick up the frames here while we're here. Wow. Got a lot of them. Got more than enough frames for us to start digging. And can I make the auger, actually? Before we go, let's let's figure out if we can do the auger. I, I don't know if we can through here. If this is a place, this is all tools, auger, parts. Uh, this is not it. Is this here? I know here. So it'll probably be on this bench. Auger. Yeah, you can craft it here. Can you do HT go HD auger? We need blades and stuff. I'll have to work on most of the stuff. Can I, oh god. Or we have to find the stuff. I think we have to find it. I thought we could actually craft it. I don't think we can. No, I don't think we can. I thought we can actually make the actual auger stuff. We cannot do it. Hmm. Auger blade, we can. To make that, you need some iron and some clay. So, a little HD auger crafted on a weapon and smithing workstation. Alright, there we go. Auger blade. Let's do auger and see what else we can, all of them we can actually do here. What am I missing? Clay? I got clay. I got enough stuff here. You need a required tool. I think I need a... Oh, That's what I'm probably going to need. Do I have calipers anywhere? I do. I just need an anvil. Let's see if we can actually do this, guys. I want to build that auger. I'm going to crucible here. Turn you off. For now, 29 seconds. Oops. Let's turn you off. I have one here. I think I have another one in the chest back there, too. I think it's the last one. I think I found two calipers. I'm not positive. It could be completely wrong. Well, it's funny if it's actually the calipers that's needed. I'm almost out of... Oh. Maybe it's the, uh, yeah, I think it might be the anvil. All right, let's just move back to it. Oh, we got ourselves some company. Uh, they're going to destroy my spikes for no reason. Can I just get this back? Thank you. So while we wait for this. Auger blade. Let's make two of those. Auger parts. Two of those. Auger. Oh, there you go. Eco blade. Damn it. Why can't I craft that? You don't know the required recipe. Okay, I'm going to have to go and check that out. Alright, I'm coming for you guys, you sons of bitches. You're damn loud. I'm trying to build over here so I don't have to dig so long. Oh, this is just a mess.
There you go. Man eater. We just complete another one. Damn, sometimes. There we go. We're all good. Just give me all I want. Give me all the goodies. Nothing, oh my god. Cheapest son of a bitch. Alright, well, nothing phenomenal. Let's get rid of bodies here. I won't do the slice of dice for no reason. Oh, damn it. I wanna to, to hit nothing inside. It's all good. Done. So, you have to learn the auger. I didn't know we could actually learn that. See, I'm learning. I'm learning too. Uh, auger. Ooh. High endurance, right? Trees with class 21. Uh, economic auger can be only used in the purchase and the trades. And economic does make sense to me. Uh, but I do want the HD too. All right, let's do it. I bought both because we had to test them out. I might have been the blade for no reason, the other auger blade, but it's okay. It's not the end of the world. Let's open this up. Let's take these pieces here again. Let's do auger. And we should have HD. I feel like building a little bit each. I'll build one of each. Reason why is because I want to see what the, each the difference between both of these ones. Uh, these ones we can actually just scrap. Screw that. Or just shoot them back in a fire. I guess it does it work that guy? Does it let me? Yeah, it does. That's perfect. All right. There's the actual HD. That's the HD. This is the economic one. There we go. This is good. And we're going to do auger. Let's just do blah, recipe. It's not in here. Is it in here? Okay, now we got the parts and stuff. Let's just assemble this uh, baby up and see. We need an engine. Uh, missing HD engine. And we need an eco one for the other one. I think I have both. I saw an HD engine. There's an eco. And I don't think it makes a difference, the quality. So we're going to just do, uh, actually maybe it does make a difference. I need a speed. I don't know. We'll mess around with it. Why am I, am I sweating? Okay, I'm sweating. Let's also get something to eat. It'll be the first time I assemble it myself in auger. I'm kind of proud of this. This going to be a good moment here. Not only one, I'm going to be doing a double shot. That's, that's what I'm talking about right there. Let's make sure it's 100. Make yourself happy. Okay, so I've grabbed everything pretty much out of this chest here, <laughs> just because I'm going to start making these bars here. Uh, so from what I'm looking at, we just need Kevlar and stuff for the tungsten hollow bars, which is great. We happen to have more than enough tungsten and Kevlar and other things, so we'll craft that up. It'll take 15 seconds. And we have the steel handle bars too for the other one. So we're going to have both of these done. So we're going to test out these eco-friendly and the HD and see what the better one is to get. That is definitely a question I had to ask myself many times. And we'll see whether or not that, which one falls into the category is the best one. We'll drop off all the other stuff here, including Kevlar here. Sweet, sweet Kevlar. Didn't realize I was going to come in that handy with that early. That is nice. And here, we can actually turn you off else than wasting. Actually, uh, uh, yeah, I'll put the lead here for now, temporarily. Just for shits and giggles. Put the shoes over here. Anything else, we'll just drop off on the other side here. Just really quick, I'm going to drop off. Great. Just because. And I'm actually going to upgrade also my shovel. I got leg boosters all over. I got them all. All right, let's go over here. And I'm actually going to be doing also upgrading this shovel since I already did it once before. I had made a few more without thinking about doing the auger. There we go. Got a 500 shovel. And from here, we'll be able to pull in the two parts here I need. Boom, boom. And here we go. HD. Let's assemble that baby up. And finally, tungsten. She's done. She's ready to go. And we're going to do the same thing with Eco, Assemble, and we'll put the steel one inside, and she's ready to go. Now, it's not the best quality, guys. 
It isn't the super quality. It isn't anything phenomenal, but it's going to just at least test it out. It'll be well worthwhile to test out. All right, we're going to need some fuel for this, and I'm pretty sure I have some here. Uh, let's do four. Let's do recipes, gas. And there we go. We'll get tons of fuel popping in here. Boom, boom. And that should be more enough for us to do it. Let's go ahead out there and check this out at night. Why not? Why wouldn't you want to do it at nighttime? That's the best time. Let's go drive our bike. We got two of our augers rolling at full throttle. We can actually fuel them up if we want to. I'm going to keep this. Pressing our refuel. It's the first time I ever do this. I can't wait to test this baby out. Oh, I can't wait to test her out. Get me on the bike. Get me on the bike. Oh, it's dark. I always got to go past our trees here, which we planted, and it's right on the back end of this where we're starting to build. It is very dark. But thankfully enough, we got our, our headlights, which should be just fine. I should be able to find it because it's, well, there's a little bit of a build there, so it should be pretty easy, you would think. But I also need to find the place to put down my bike. You would think it'd be easy. I know it's here somewhere. Wow, it is not as easy as it looks. Looking for this at nighttime. I got to put some torches down. I'm not seeing it whatsoever. What the frig? Got to be closer in this way. There she is. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, we're okay. We're okay. Let's back our bike. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, turn off the lights, please. All right, we got one light here, which is perfectly fine. All right, first one to try out. We're going to be trying out this one here. It's just eco. Let's see what the eco can do. We'll do one full side. Oh, man, this is sweet. I never got to try one of these. This is so nice. Way better than digging. Okay. ginger with it. Okay, so it leaves a little bit of divots. I don't like that. I'm used to digging where everything's kind of controlled. But it's a whole lot faster. That is pretty darn sweet. That is pretty darn sweet. Uh, we are down one with a down two more. Well, one more each side. <laughs> it actually moves up your skills too. That's unbelievable. Let's grab all this. Almost out of fuel. I'm just checking up right hand side bottom. I got this a lower level, so I don't know if a higher level does a better job. All right. So this is about as one and a half total, and uh, this one here. Actually, I'm going to put down the frames and stuff. Just make sure we get this done properly. Rebar frames. Oh, it's because I have way too much. All right, so that's the eco-friendly one. Let's just get this across here. It's not finalized. not even close to being finished. Just going to drop them down here so I know what's left to be done and also to kind of set these up anyway so it's not a big deal not a big deal there we go drop drop there's another one here 
Yeah, it's a little bit up and down. It's, it's not perfect, is it? It's not perfect doing this. Uh, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. It's it's a lesson learned. It's a lesson learned. All right, from here. From this point here. There's that one here like that. And then we can take out these ones. Okay. There we go. From this point here, we'll have it right on the corner. I want to test this out, that's why. Okay. So we're going to start from this side. Oh man, this is faster. Gotta be careful so we don't dig where we don't want to dig. Whoops. Like that. Holy crap, this is super fast. I think I actually went one. Oh, no, should be okay. Can I move this out? It's a little hard to see it when it's this light. Bet you'll lose her in a daylight. Oh man, HD is rocking. Oh shit. It's also not as well as it's me who's going to take my time with it, but it's because I'm enjoying it so much. It's super fast. And he used up not as much fuel, and I took out more stuff. That is interesting. Okay, so the first block is there. That's block, and we can do one more. Man, it really eats up really quick. Holy shit. Oh, here's my first auger. One I've ever built. <laughs> All right, after that test, you know, if I made a little mistakes and stuff on the other side, uh, this HD is definitely the best one overall, it seems like. Uh, I'll test it a little more. I'll have both running anyways in case I, I run out of the other one, but this is definitely, definitely a whole lot faster. Um, hands down, I think that, that beats the living crap out of the other ones. Let's just grab this all the way across here. I think we should be okay. We should have a couple of divots here, there, and a little hole here. Whoops. To worry about nothing too big. This is actually a little bit deeper, isn't it? Yeah, I went a little bit deeper and I shut up. That's ah, okay. Whatever. I have a lot of resources, thankfully. I made a boo-boo. Probably put wood frames, but it's okay. It's all good. It was worth the fun with the HD. We can just go across and get it all done and completed. There we go. I then want to drop on another bunch of frames here. And we're good. Yeah, I'm going to be doing this for the rest of the night, guys. Getting myself kind of prepared, getting this, this portion done and trying to get the rest of it dug out. So I'm going to leave you guys here. Uh, well, there's not much night left, but there's still work to be done on this base and plenty. So thank you so much for being here, guys. I really do appreciate it. Again, if you guys like this series, you want to see more of it, please do not forget the like button. This is your game image. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.